Hello everyone, welcome back to Malapi Channel, where you can learn more interesting info about your favorite actors and athletes. In today's video, we'll be discussing the iconic professional boxer, activist, entertainer, poet, and philanthropist Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali was born Cassius Marcellus Clay Jr. on January 17, 1942 in Louisville, Kentucky, and died of septic shock on June 3, 2016, at the age of 74 in Scottsdale, Arizona. Nicknamed the greatest, he is widely regarded as one of the most significant and celebrated sporting figures of the 20th century, and is frequently ranked as the best heavyweight boxer and greatest athlete of the century. Throughout his late career, Muhammad Ali participated in 61 fights and only lost 5 of them. One of six children, he was named after his father, Cassius Marcellus Clay Sr. His father painted billboard signs and his mother, Odessa O'Grady Clay, stayed at home to raise Cassius and his younger brother. He attended Central High School in Louisville and struggled with learning disorder throughout school. Growing up amid racial segregation, Cassius experienced many acts of racial injustice and prejudice. He was profoundly affected by the 1955 murder of Emmett Till, which led to him and a friend vandalizing a local rail yard in a showing in protest. Ali was married four times and has seven daughters and two sons. He married his first wife, cocktail waitress Sanchi Roy, in 1964 after meeting each other for a month. The marriage was childless and they divorced in January 1966. In 1967, he married his second wife, Belina Boy. They have four children, author and rapper Miriam May May, twins Jamila and Rashida, and Muhammad Ali Jr. While still married to Belinda, Ali had two more daughters named Callie and Mia from his extramarital relationships. In 1977, due to his second marriage ended, Ali married actress and model Veronica Sporcia. They had two children together. Hannah and Layla Ali, who is now a retired professional boxer. They got divorced in 1986. Ali married Yolanda Williams, who had been his close friend since 1964. They adopted a son, Asad Amin. Cassius Clay began training as an amateur boxer at the age of 12, after his bike was stolen and a police officer on the scene advised him to learn boxing. As an amateur boxer, his biggest achievement was winning the light heavyweight gold medal at the 1960 Olympics in Rome. His amateur record was 100 wins and 5 losses. 
After the Olympics, Clay returned to Louisville, where he began his professional career. And in the next three years, he won all 19 of his fights, began to build a reputation for himself. Clay won the World Heavyweight Championship from Sonny Liston in a major upset on February 25, 1964, at the age of 22. In March 1964, he announced that he no longer would be known as Cassius Clay, but as Muhammad Ali. Before his final retirement in 1981, Ali had total 61 fights, reclaiming the world title twice, whilst losing only five times. Several were outstanding, the fights with Joe Frazier, such as the fight of the century, which has been called the biggest boxing event, if not the biggest sporting event of all time, and the thriller in Manila, and also his fight with Jewish foreman, known as the Rumble in the Jungle. However, Ali's most remembered for his speed in the ring, including his speed of punch, assess is one of the fastest ever, at any weight as well as his sometimes controversial personality, particularly his ability to deliver monologues which rival his physical speed. Muhammad Ali remains the only three-time Lionel Heavyweight Champion. He's the only boxer to be named the Ring Magazine Fighter of the Year six times, and was involved in more Ring Fighter of the Year bouts than any other fighter. He's been ranked as the great sportsman of the 20th century by Sports Illustrated and the Sports Personality of the Century by the BBC. Ali was inducted into the International Boxing Hall of Fame in his first year. After retiring from boxing, he focused on religion, philanthropy, and activism. Two controversies in particular were his conversion to Islam, at which point he also changed his name to Muhammad Ali, claiming that his birth name was that of a 19th century slave anyway. Then his objection to serving in the U.S. forces during the war in Vietnam saw him jailed and stripped off his world boxing champion status in 1967. The former decision was overturned some years later. Sadly, Muhammad Ali died of septic shock on June 3, 2016, at the age of 74 in Scottsdale, Arizona. His memorial was well attended by fellow sports speakers and celebrities and was watched by an estimated 1 billion viewers worldwide. The late boxer had a net worth of $50 million at the time of his death. In 1984, he made public his diagnosis of Parkinson's syndrome, which some reports attribute to boxing-related injuries, though he and his specialist physicians disputed this. He remained an active public figure globally, but in his later years made fewer public appearances as his condition worsened and was cared for by his family. Outside the ring, Ali attained success as a spoken word artist, where he received two Grammy nominations. He also featured as an actor and writer, releasing two autobiographies. And that's all for today, and we hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment below if you have any recommendations for our channel, and don't forget to hit like and subscribe to support us. Thank you for watching, goodbye!